Welcome to Jurassic Park. Alright, so this is Brandon Hayes with Anthony Dinar, and today we're playing some Jurassic Park for SNES. Oh, and get me some dinosaurs! Good luck with this game, because I tried to play it uh, just maybe like 10 minutes before you did, you know, like, just, just trying to check it out to see if it'd be worth recording, and um, I couldn't figure it out. Couldn't figure out any objectives, like what's the point of this game? What are you supposed well, to do? You're stupid. Oh shit. <sighs> are they just leave you alone? I guess so. Fuck you. Fuck you. There's like three of them, two of them walking around. That's insane. You keep going down here knowing that these big dinosaurs are down here, and I don't know why. Because there's nowhere else to go. You can go out of the pen. Or you could be a man kill and one. kill one. <laughs> oh. Well, going down does nothing. Okay, so can I go up here? Yeah, I don't have to go in the pen. Interesting. So I know if you shoot that thing right in front of you with the electric, yeah. But then you gotta run out the gate. <laughs> what? <laughs> and it electrocuted you wait. me. See, like, your charge there oh. is, like, how much charge you have on that weapon. So you got to let it go all the way full and then shoot as much as you can at that thing to open up the gate as much as possible and then run. That's stupid. <laughs> okay. Isn't that kid supposed to be lost? <laughs> wow, we get it. Dinosaurs are terrible. Yeah, and can I get that off the screen, please? That's gonna hurt me, right? I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. So I didn't shoot them this time, they still ran. Oh, come on! <laughs> Why do I have like a fucking target sign on the bottom? I don't know, it doesn't seem to be doing anything. And neither is this game. Get <laughs> I can't see the stampeding Gallimimus if that thing is in my way. <laughs> Fucker. That was really gratifying killing that dinosaur. Yeah. Yeah! Grant. Okay, well that's the first thing that's been close to an objective. Yeah. Of course, I don't see any eggs anywhere. Can we just, like, touch the things? Nope. You gotta fucking wrap that wound. <laughs> Wait, what? You just switched weapons. Uh, this looks like a tranquilizer. I don't want to incapacitate any dinosaurs. I want them fucking dead. We don't know what, uh, what it is. Try and hit one first. Fuck you. Oh, see? One hit kill. That's cool. Ugh. 
I forgot about this. <laughs> Is he asleep? <laughs> Okay, so what would you do, Brad? What's your social security number? <laughs> <laughs> That's longer than three digits. So they want the mark of the beast, right? So nothing's working. Oh, the exit button works. Oh, I hate these half-assed 3D parts in games like this. <laughs> it's so slow. By the time I see the dinosaur, it's too late. <laughs> <laughs> it only took 12 hits. What oh. the fuck? Where'd that guy come from? I don't know. I'm out of... You found those already. Well, I ran out of the other weapon. What was this? Leisure Suit Larry? <laughs> what the fuck? Is this an elevator? I guess. You can't strafe left or right. Am I in the same room? Yes. So confusing. There's nothing in here. I don't think I used the elevator correctly. God, that looks like a fucking strip club. Okay, what does that mean to you? Down button B, right house. Exit, select. I hit B. Left mouse, right... It this is now like a select. legit Super Nintendo game. Why is it saying it like it's a computer game? Left mouse, right mouse, click, like... It might be house, like you originally said. I can't tell. So what would you do? Hit select. Let me go down again, or hit select? Okay, fine. So complicated. See, now you're in a different Ugh, part. I didn't even get out of the elevator. Well, the doors in this game don't give you a lot of time. You gotta move your ass, but um, you are in a different section now. I don't understand why some dinosaurs just stand there. Hey, that's good with me. Oh, uh, really? Give me a black. Oh no! <laughs> that was not the way I came in! Can you just jump down there? <laughs> oh, that's bullshit! <laughs> okay, you you fucking saw it. Like that that made no sense. Okay. Going down, and I'm gonna go down again, and now I'm gonna hit select. Go toward the door. <laughs> okay, there's the trees. Uh, this came out so much later than, like, Wolfenstein 3D. Um, you think they would be able to do a better 3D thing than this? Like, I'm walking around like I'm fucking drunk. You know what this feels like? It feels like one of those 
fake video games, like one of those plug and play yeah, video games. It certainly does. Ain't that the truth? <laughs> so close. He turned into a piece of chicken. <laughs> hey, they are kind of like chickens, aren't they? It's like hard to walk in a straight line. This is ridiculous. Hammond didn't give you security clearance. <laughs> he doesn't want you to succeed, Brad. You're against his park. Die. Mm. Oops. Meanwhile, remember Malcolm's warning about raptor eggs? Yeah. I haven't seen a single egg. Yeah, me neither. So, if you could just shoot him at a distance... Whew. My last shot, too. You're better off. Walk straight. I'm trying. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's like I want to see like the room. I I don't know. Look for dinosaurs. I you can't strafe left or right. How'd you get night vision? I guess it just turned on automatically because it's dark in here. So then, how come you got kicked out to the last main time? entrance last time? Because I didn't have the goggles. I don't know. It's like, uh, remember Zelda in the, uh, the Lost Woods? Like, you make the wrong exit. How am I in an elevator again? How deep is this? Is this fucking Raccoon City? Like, <laughs> this makes no sense. Oh. So, do you think this is the real game? Like, the outside is just sort of like the map screen God, to I, get you from level to level. But I hope not. This is what majority of the gameplay looks like. I hope not. Because the other one actually plays better. <laughs> it's just doors <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> they want to make sure you get nice and lost in here. Yeah. So did you get this far? No, I never even got inside this building. So we're at like level what? 13 underground? <laughs> no, it was sub level 1. Meanwhile, how deep does this thing need to be? It's just a pen for raptors. Yeah, I don't know. I love how they explode. I have full life and it took the life. God damn it. So you're not pushing a button when you... Not in here. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, like, I, I don't mind, I guess, having to press a button, but, like, let's be consistent, you know? Like, outside, you have to press a button to pick up the life. In here, it's just walking over it, even if you have full life. These sections were probably designed by two entirely different teams. Yeah. I want to see someone who has no life who uh, who made a map of this. You know they exist. I know. And I I want to use it. <laughs> well, you can look it up on Game FAQs or something. Well, I can't really even tell what I'm looking at here. I know, me neither. Um, I like how the... Okay, so Jurassic Park, the whole thing went crazy. A bunch of dinosaurs escaped. Um, and then there was mass panic. That all happened within, you know, a day or so, right? In the movie, yeah. The um, otherwise, this place was a brand new facility, and everything was working fine. Yeah. So, like, why are all the walls like rusted, rusted out? Rusted out. Like this place has been abandoned for years. Spare no expense. God, I feel like an old man. This doesn't make any sense. Fucking youth and their video games. 
<laughs> it doesn't make sense. It looks like garbage. I can't even tell what I'm looking at. <laughs> the motion's making me kind of sick. <laughs> but I have a hard time believing that a kid would find this fun. No. Like if we knew like an eight-year-old kid and just said, here, play this for a while. I bet they would get bored in like five minutes. Well, like to really test that out, you have to go to like an eight-year-old kid, what, 20 years ago? You were alive back then. There was nothing going on. I never played this game, though. So I don't know if I would have been occupied with this. And I was older than eight when this came out, but... <laughs> like that dinosaur died of gas fumes. That's actually kind of cool. I like all the different ways that you can murder innocent animals in this. They are pretty much innocent because they're not attacking you unless you <laughs> step up to them and get in their personal space. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's funny. I think I know what that counter is at the top now. It's like how many times you swear at the video game. <laughs> I think I'm at 712. <laughs> Actually, like, it increases when you kill the dinosaurs, so I think it's really your score. Oh, cool. See, it wants you to kill these things. Fucking bastards, they deserve it. <laughs> Why didn't that work? Ah! Wow. You got an ID card. So, remember that door that I didn't have clearance for? Why would Malcolm have clearance to this? He was a fucking, like, mathematician. No, it was Muldoon. He oh. was the hunter guy. But, um, I think that card will work in that green computer screen. Yeah. Because it did have a Good card Good luck slot. trying to get all the way to the, the fucking beginning again. God forbid this place is built up to code and it has exit signs with arrows and shit. <laughs> and uh, that fucking ID card looked a lot like health. If I didn't need health, I wouldn't have picked it up. I thought it was health too. <laughs> I like how there are different versions of health. Sometimes it's a chicken leg and sometimes it's just a med kit. Yeah. I think we're just watching you walk around in circles. I think so, too. I, I'm so lost. This video is going to be hell to edit because I try to keep things interesting and <laughs> like, avoid showing things for too long. Yeah. You know, like the same scenes, same levels and stuff. And I don't think you're ever getting out of here. Access denied. I need Grant's ID card. I already have an ID card, but it's not Grant's. This is stupid. Why does Grant Wait, have an ID card? Aren't you Grant? Oh my god, I am Grant! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> you picked a dumb game to play. You know, maybe you're not Grant. Maybe you're just a generic guy and all the other main characters are someplace else great so i'm like i'm the red shirt no one knows on star trek who's doomed to die possibly i just want to get outside i'm getting claustrophobic in here and dizzy you know even in wolfenstein 3d they didn't use the same textures non-stop yeah. like some rooms did look different yeah The card did nothing. There's- this did nothing. Oh my fucking god, this did nothing. Let's get out of here. I, I've had it. I've had it. Yeah, but then the, the game is, is over. This is it. Like, what's the point? He specifically said raptors. Would it be funny if that just opened up? <laughs> <laughs> Oops. I don't know, you might get other things to do if you walk around enough. Fucking Hammond.
him, that piece of shit. Fuck you! Fuck you! Go down and just follow the water. Oh, never mind. Fucking hate this game. Fucking hate Hammond. Well, maybe I could shoot him, Malcolm, if you didn't take up the whole goddamn screen. Continue. Oh, it starts you off right here. That's wow. cool. It's a trip. What the fuck is this building? Have I gone in this one? Oh, if it looks exactly the same, I'm gonna scream. <laughs> Come on, your fat ass can fit! F uh, fucking no. Grant wannabe. <laughs> Get off my screen! Wow. So they do have the ability to change the, uh, the fucking walls. I have a feeling it's just gonna be the same bullshit. Oh, just of like course! This horrible maze that leads nowhere. So, why do I have, like, the silhouette of me? And, three times? Yeah. Like, because I have three health, maybe, and three lives, but then, like, why aren't they all in the same spot? It can you only get a maximum of four? Should I go up another level? It doesn't even tell me what level is what. Like, you know, level, sub-level one, it only tells you once you leave. Yeah, I don't know the answers to any of those questions. Um, I would maybe assume that those bases are... ID cards or something? No, because I only got one. Okay, so what is that thing right there? It's an incubator. Should I try to shoot it? I don't care. Let's kill some <laughs> unborn ones. Let's go! Woo! Uh, access denied. <laughs> access denied. Dennis. Remember all the characters you loved in the movie? Don't you wish you were any of them? You can collect all their ID cards. What does that thing say? Biological hazard? Back up so I can read that poster. Okay, so this is the visitor center, right? Yep. Well, I'm outside on top of the building now. So that's good. This is, okay, so, like, I go to Wikipedia, and you never know if this stuff's accurate or whatever, but one of the things it says about this game, it says, In May 2015, approximately 300 copies of the game were listed on sale at a buy-it-now price of $1,500. What? It's certainly not what I paid for this. Yeah, no. Oh, the player controls Alan Grant. So you are Grant! Oh, I found Hammond's ID card. On the top of a fucking building. Jurassic Park supports the SNES mouse. So that's why oh, it was. It's another made that way. fucking gimmick. The game typically takes anywhere from two to three hours to complete. Bullshit. Oh, I got one egg. 17 eggs left! Oh my god! <laughs> Here it goes. Some objectives, such as collecting all 18 raptor eggs, can slow down the progress of a typical player. Typical. The game does not utilize a save feature. The player, therefore, is required to play through the entire game in a single sitting. No. <laughs> wow, this was originally planned to be released August 1993, after being unveiled to a disappointed audience in Chicago's Consumer Electronics Show. Uh, the game's graphics were redone. Wow, this is the redone version? This is the enhanced version.
Edge magazine said, To begin with, a lot of time is spent aimlessly wandering around and avoiding dinosaurs, with very little help is given in which direction you should be going exactly. SNES Force Magazine gave the game a 92% rating and praised its huge playing area. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think I'm done. Wow, listen to this. Jonathan Davies of Superplay Magazine gave the game an 89% rating and praised its colorful graphics, problem-solving tactics, and bird's-eye perspective. However, Davies criticized the game for being a bit too easy. Oh, fuck <laughs> that guy. Yeah, Electronic Gaming Monthly gave this game a 7.25 out of 10. Although they commented that the game was too easy. Yeah, there's a speedrun of this game listed on YouTube that uh, takes less than an hour. The guy says, overall, I felt like it was a really good game. Oh, I can jump over those? <laughs> oh wow. my god. Fuck you! God! Uh, he can't fly over that. Stupid. Sixteen eggs left. I'm reading a uh, walkthrough right now, and the guy says, Jurassic Park is one of the few good movie games. <laughs> I guess we're just missing something here. Apparently this is a fucking outstanding game. Yeah, you're just a hater, Brad. Oh, L and R cancel tips from your friends. So when that shit pops up, you can just push those buttons and get rid of it. How? L and R. Just one or the oh, other, okay. I would assume. Or maybe both at the same time. It's like the same tips over and over again. Don't shoot the Cali Mimus or whatever. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. I'm stuck. Oh, you have to do a lot in this game. Turn on the generators. Reboot the computer system. Stop the raptors from entering the visitor center. Clear the ship of dinosaurs. Collect all the raptor eggs. Use the satellite link to keep the ships in the harbor. Destroy the raptor nest with a nerve gas bomb. Call the mainland for a ride. Get to the helipad. Great, so you've seen the movie, right? Eh, eh, I'm done. <laughs> Dude, would you play this? Fuck no. I got like three raptor eggs and that's it. Yeah, no, it. this game isn't fun. I, I don't understand why everyone gave it such high ratings. Um, ooh, trivia. I think maybe um, people were just amazed by how open it was, but still, like, you're going to need a walkthrough or something. Yeah. You need some, I guess maybe they were selling strategy guides at the time. Yeah, absolutely. So that's how people were getting through it and having fun. Like, if this is all I had to do or whatever, and, like, I don't know. I had some sort of incentive to show off that I could actually do it because there was nothing else to play. But we had Mario back then, so I don't get it. At least you can, like, play and play and play until, you know, you give up. You know, it may like, the game makes you a quitter. That's kind of cool. It's not like... Those other games that are way too fucking hard and, like, you always start over. But, like, you gotta do this all in one sitting. Fucking mom isn't gonna let you do that. She's gonna bitch at you to do your homework or go to bed or something, right? So, like, you gotta get this shit down. You gotta, like, know every door in there and... <sighs> yeah, and again, you rent this for a weekend and even if it came with instruction book, I don't think that... They would give you maps and yeah. shit? No. 
And so you would be playing just like we did, just like going in blind, basically. Yeah. And you'd be completely lost. And then you would never rent this game or buy this game after. Yeah, it's like uh, Jurassic Park was like Highlander. You know, like Highlander had the one good movie and then everything else was <laughs> shit. The movies, the show, the cartoon, everything was crap. Yeah. And Jurassic Park's the same thing. Like it had the one good movie and then everything else was garbage. Yeah. We should make a video of us breaking these things. <laughs> <laughs>